What's up, you guys? Welcome back to our channel. So if you guys are new to our channel, hi, welcome. I'm Jen, and this is my sister, Cynthia. Today, you guys, we created these two looks using drugstore makeup. Yes, you heard us drug right. Drugstore drug and store. affordable, because mm -hmm. all of it was not from there, but... Pretty affordable, you guys. Pretty affordable. affordable. We ain't talking like 50 bucks. We're talking about like 15 bucks. <laughs> Max. Max, yeah. We went to Ulta to get some drugstore. So if you guys don't know this, I'm sure you guys know. Ulta does have drugstore and then high end. So we went to the drugstore section and got like whatever drugstore Everything we can find. Everything that's affordable. Yeah. And then we had our own drugstore products as well that we did include. And actually, you guys, we did our brows using the new Beauty Creation Brow Kit, right? Was it the kit? It's the pomade. <laughs> it's the brow gel. And then the pencil. Oh, and the then brush. the brush with the Fully yeah affordable which is why everything that's why we included their products because we're like you know what this is like you know what i'm saying it's drugstore slash affordable makeup tutorial you know what i'm saying but our brows you guys we didn't do it on camera so we did mention that in the video so if you guys do want to see a tutorial you know what i'm saying with us doing our brows or how we do them just to kind of give you like some tips on like you know what i'm saying whatever let us know down below if you guys would like to see that using beauty creations or another affordable or comparing a high-end and affordable brow products we one. could do that too i actually did that on my channel it's a super old video where and your brows are still the same yeah i did um half which was affordable brow product and then high end and it literally came out the same so i mean if you guys want to see an updated version on our channel let us know down below and of course we do have a giveaway for you guys so make sure you guys stay tuned till the end of this video so if you guys want to see how we created these two looks and the products that we purchased then just keep on watching Okay, okay, so we are starting their face. We already have our face prepped. And we actually did our brows, you guys, using Beauty Creations. This is their brow, their new brow product they came out with. Brow pomade. In the shade Dark Brown. We both use this one. And I went in with their pencil as well. It's in the same shade. It came in like the kit that included the pencil, then the, the brush. pomade, the, brush. the brow tame setting gel, and then the brush. Oh, this one with the spoolie. So I didn't use this brush. I did use the products, the pomade, the pencil, and the gel. But um, I used my own dip brow brush because I don't know, I just love it. Did you use this one or you used your own? Oh, you did? I don't know, I'm so picky when it comes to brushes. I didn't even bother looking at it, to be honest. I thought it was just a spoolie when you gave it to me. Yeah, it's not like precise. Like obviously I would prefer the Anastasia yeah, one the Anastasia as well. One but so I ended up cleaning up my brows anyway, so I really didn't care that it wasn't as precise as I wanted it. So the brows are done. So the primer we went in, with is the elf cosmetics poreless putty primer honestly like my favorite primer is the cover fx one that's like my all-time favorite primer i freaking love it or the one i was telling you the benefit professional that one's so bomb you guys the one from cover fx the blur one and then the benefit one those two like for sure will give you like that smooth surface well i actually use that this is her first time trying it yeah but it's my I, first time i always use it i use it every day i would say it's pretty good because a lot of drugstore primers that i have tested i don't like how they kind of like smear off your face or don't even try to smooth out your skin you know what i'm saying like it doesn't give you that smooth surface so this one was pretty good for being like a drugstore primer so um i went ahead and got this mascara because i ran out this is like our top mascara like drugstore it's like our favorite one and oh no, my favorite overall overall like, there's no high-end one i like that's the only mascara i use the prices of these products will be right here on the screen for you guys we got this palette which is so cool like this brand is i we've never I love, tried it i love revolution so the foundation we chose because we've never used it i know people have talked good about this one so i'm like let's just try it but there was two kinds remember there was two la girl foundations there was that one and there was like another yeah, I don't one remember what the other i don't one know what was, the other but one was. this is the pro matte mm -hmm. one and then we got this setting mist from i love revolution and it is dewy fixing spray so it smells like watermelon you guys it smells really it smells good. pretty good you guys we also got this from that brand yeah this is the chocolate contour bar, the shade light. Another thing from the brand is this setting powder we got. We really wanted to open it because there were several ones and it doesn't say here like if it's translucent or what. Oh yeah, I think it is. Yeah. Juvia's Place um, highlighter. They have this at Ulta. I hope this counts as drugstore, you guys. I know they don't really have this at Target or not even sure CVS or like other places where they sell drugstore, but- That's really cool. Like, you know, it was in the drugstore section. Trippy. And then, of course, some lashes. I went ahead and got Ardell Remy lashes. Here's the lashes I got. 
And I don't really like drugstore lashes. It's always really hard for me to find one that I like because I have big eyes and I like them. I like them more voluminous and more like long and exaggerated. These are affordable. They're not at the drugstore, yeah, but mean, they're the beauty creation. It should be one. I've never used them. Drugstore. And then, oh, we didn't say this. Oh yeah. The concealer. So this is LA Girl Concealer. This is Pro Concealer HD High Definition in the shade Bisque, it says. Did we say which shade that one was in? We chose the shade Light Tan. And then for lips, obviously everybody knows ColourPop is affordable. So I'm just gonna use one of my lip liners. And then of course your girl needs a lip gloss. I freaking love lip gloss. This is my sexy mother pucker um, lip gloss in the shade Nude Star. So now let's get into creating a look. Actually you guys forgot these. I did show you guys in my last, one of our last videos. I'm not sure which video it was, but Real Techniques Little Sponges. Sorry, it's open, so I'm like holding it right here. And they're so cute, you guys. I freaking love these sponges for like my concealer. And then I have an e.l.f. sponge as well. And this one, you guys, works so good. I freaking love this one. Yeah, that's what I'm gonna be using to apply my foundation and concealer. And I'm gonna use some more too. So we're gonna go ahead and show you guys a little clip right here on the screen of the palette so you guys can see up close and you know all the pretty colors from this palette. Of course, I have not looked, like really looked in this palette and decided on what look I'm gonna be creating because my ass is just like that, I don't know why. But as you can see, the colors are just so pretty and there's so much to work with here. It has like an equal amount of shimmers and mattes mm -hmm. and there's a variety. There's warm tones, cool tones. That's oh, what I really like cool. about it. Oh, how cool, they're like movie theater -y like lights down cinema theater back row sweet and salty sequel this is cute like Caramel i really corn. love the products with this line like i'm gonna go back and get some more because they're just so cute and we i did cheat and i swatched them ahead of time well some of them because cheat. i wanted to like kind of plan out my look and they swatch really nicely the pigmentation like, so good you they're guys. like soft mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. i think i'm gonna start with my foundation first so since i didn't start with her eyeshadow i'm starting with my foundation okay so i feel I feel like this foundation is pretty dark. We, we anticipated that. The next shade down that they had was too light. We'd rather get a little bit darker and try and work with it. Yeah, that's what I told her. I said, you know what? If it's dark, like screw it. We just gotta conceal better. To brighten up. Yeah. To brighten up our complexion. Mm -hmm. But I actually like the coverage of this foundation because it's just right away just good coverage. And is it mattifying? It feels, it looks. Yeah, it is matte. Oh. Okay, so now I'm gonna be taking the concealer. You guys, and I am using affordable brushes as well. Just so you know. I know, I did wanna buy some makeup brushes, but we're like, well, girl, we can save some money and use some of the kind of drugstore. One and some Morphe one. Yeah, like those are super affordable brushes. Like they should be considered drugstore. So now I'm just gonna blend that out using my little Real Techniques beauty sponge okay so i do think the concealer really helped to brighten up this foundation and you can really see that highlight from the concealer so that means it's good so now i'm gonna go in with this setting powder so i went in with the shade fernal and then i went in with the shade caramel corn just to deepen it up and then I ended up going back in with the uh, concealer and I cut my crease. And now I'm gonna go in with the blue shade Poppin and then right after that, snack card. So now I'm going to be doing my eyes. So I'm gonna be taking the shade Movie. It's like a very light purple, kind of like a lilac. So I added that shade Snack Cart in the inner part of my eye and then the outer part. And then the center is that blue pop in. We actually didn't buy an eyeliner. Luckily, I had this one. It's the Wet n Wild Mega Liner. I've actually never tried it. I usually use the e.l.f. one. So I'm gonna go ahead and add a wing liner. Okay, so I kind of felt like the shade movie was looking a little bit too gray. So I went in with Sweet and Salty to kind of give it some like more purple tone. You know what I'm saying? Because the Sweet and Salty had like a little pink undertone to it. So now I'm gonna go ahead and cut my crease. Okay guys, so we went ahead and finished up our looks. So the other color that I did not show you, well the shade that I did not show you from this palette was Back Row and that is the shimmer I used on top of the cut crease that I did. And by the way, you guys, excuse our family. I'm sure you guys can hear them. They're super loud and they're there's no way we that. can like shut them up. They're just enjoying their lives or whatever. So yeah. And on the bottom lash, I did add the first two colors I went in with and then a little bit of that shimmer that I use back row, right? Yeah. 
and I did use the e.l.f. liquid liner and popped on these lashes and they just look so good you guys look how wispy they are they're just like so me I love these type of lashes yeah I just went in with all purple I kind of wanted to go with purple because my shirt had purple on it so I'm like okay I just kind of want an all purple type of look and that's exactly what I went in with and obviously you guys saw me do my foundation but the blush we did use we both actually use this blush it is the L'Oreal True it's Match really pretty, I like yeah it. it's such a nice soft blush this is an old blush I've sure had for like ever and I freaking love this shade baby blossom and then we went in with the highlighter and as well as this contour we're gonna go ahead and show it right here on the screen for you guys so you guys can get a better close-up on these two little palettes this you guys smelled so freaking good did you I smell, it? Didn't smell it you didn't smell it when I was putting it on it smelled so good and for my lips I went in with my lip gloss and it then a lip liner smell like it smells so good and then a lip liner of ColourPop dude I believe I use BFF it's the same one I always freaking use in like like every freaking video because I'm just like that too, type of girl too, too. and it's just like the nudest one in the whole yeah. collection and it is BFF and then of course my lip gloss um, sexy mother pucker and then Cynthia showed you all the steps all the shades she used right on my eyes yes mm -hmm. the rest of my face I pretty much did everything she did for my lips I also did use ColourPop lip liner and this one is in the shade Lumiere we haven't gone we in haven't gone in with that for sure so we need to go in on that Cynthia said well she tried she sprayed it a little bit in the air to like smell it and she said a little bit got in her mouth and she said it tastes good. Don't quote me on that and don't try it. <laughs> don't like spray it in your mouth. But I'm gonna try it. Wait, you're gonna, oh, I thought you were gonna be like, I'm gonna spray it in my mouth. <laughs> Let me try it. I didn't get it in my mouth this time. <laughs> Let me try. Oh. <laughs> Why you do that for? What the heck? <laughs> I'm telling you, I haven't eaten. Okay, okay, no, you're right. It has like a little bit of a taste of watermelon, but you can taste like I don't know if it's alcohol or Whatever like else is in it. a chemical in there. Yes, don't do it, you guys. Like, don't put it. But it smells, but it smells amazing. 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 Oh, it smells so good. Mm. What is the finish on it? It doesn't say, huh? Ooh. Oh, it says dewy, but I don't even think it made it oh, dewy. Oh, yeah, dewy. Yeah. And I'm not a fan of dewy. You guys know that. I feel like it did give, like, a little bit of a luminous, a luminaire, luminous. How I do feel you say like it? it did high, bring out my highlight a bit more. It did, like, It did. Clearly. My highlight? Oh, we did go with highlight. Like, I did go highlight a little bit, tiny bit on my cheekbones, because you guys know how I am when it comes to highlighter. Like, I'm very subtle when it comes to highlighter. So just a little bit of dab here and there. Bridge my nose. Cupid's bow. Tiny bit on my chin and on my brow right here on top to just give it that highlight but it does no it does bring out a glow you see the dewy to this what spray the highlighter and the foundation you guys it actually ended up evening even we like it i like it after i tried out. it i told her like it was a little like too dark but it comes together with the concealer it really does yeah it does the concealer i feel like was perfect to like even out and then i feel both. like the consistency is very like watery but it's like full coverage fooled. it's full coverage full coverage full like coverage. right away i was just like full coverage like i showed you guys when i was applying and i was like oh but shit, it is like matte. this is full this, coverage. i feel like they do have a one that's not matte huh the other one's probably not matte. I think the other it's one we not. saw was probably not matte. They didn't have too many shades in the other no. one when we went to Ulta. So we just got this one. The concealer as well, you guys. So freaking bomb. Bomb. I believe, honestly, yeah. this is cheaper than the foundation, I That's think. That's a thicker right? consistency, but it's full coverage. The and same. the little it's brush so on good. it is just like so perfect with it for like applying. Like small Yeah, areas. I really like it, especially when you want to highlight your nose. I'm not oh, putting yeah, you guys off, sorry. <laughs> My finger was like this your nose <laughs> yeah it was just like it was perfect i like I mean, how soft yours is i'm kind of really i actually didn't even like my eyeshadow i was telling her but she was like what are you talking about it's like nice like it is simple but like the shimmer just makes it pop cynthia's look came out so good with that pop of blue i'm like this girl with her pop of color like she really just freaking goes in with the pop of color like me i'm too scared that's what, to like, put another color my eyes gravitate towards i see a color that stands out in the palette i'm like i have to use it Instantly when I opened that palette, I swatched most of the colors and right away I'm like, I need to use that blue. It looks so good. Like it really did complete it. the look. It's so funny. She's wearing my color. I'm wearing her color. Oh yeah. <laughs> I am a blue girl. Purple, I freaking blue. love blue. It's my favorite color and purple's her favorite color. You guys stay tuned for another video using just this brand. You know what I'm saying? I love Revolution because 
so cute. You know what I'm saying? Look at this. Why does it focus? And so the fact portable. That this smells like coconut. Yes, like, I want to get the banana one now. And I really I like it too. It. Like I really like it. I actually thought it was gonna be drying because yeah, it said it the first ingredient is talk. talk. And that's what's drying. That's what's in baby powder. So I thought it was gonna suck the life out of our freaking under eyes and whatever the heck. But it didn't. It no. really did and it not. It really left it really smooth. Okay, you guys. So as you guys know, we do a giveaway at the end of each video. So for today's video, the giveaway we will be doing. Actually, we want to give a shout out to our last winner. Congrats, Boo. And thank you so much for your love and support. You guys, we truly appreciate it. I cannot believe we're at 75 subscribers. That's crazy. Today I checked that we're crazy. at 75 subscribers. And yesterday we were at what? We were at 66, you guys. Eight. We're yeah. at 75. That's freaking crazy, you guys. Like, Overnight. Oh it was my a gosh. surprise when we woke up. We woke to up see and number. we just, she texted me right when I literally saw it. Like, oh my gosh, we're at 75. So much like excitement and joy. Like, like, it that. feels so good, you guys. So, we truly, like, from like deep down, like, even at the tip of our heart, I don't know where, just our whole heart are so grateful for you guys. <laughs> and, like, it's just, we truly appreciate your love and support. And we can't thank you guys enough. But thank you so much and yeah you guys so, are the reason we continue to do these yeah videos. it's just like oh it feels so good you guys uh, it's overwhelming but like a good overwhelming like it feels so good okay so thank you you guys thank you so that's how we gotta have giveaways for you guys you know what i'm saying we gotta give back to you we guys to give back. you know you guys want to treat yourself too i don't think it's fair that we come on here you just know what show saying? off what we have, show what and, we have like, and then it's like good luck on uh, getting yeah, it bye. <laughs> you know let us know when you when you get your hands on it or something like that's so mean i mean well i don't know i mean everybody does it their own way but we want to give back you know what i'm saying so that this is our way of giving back like in every video and we will be shouting you guys out more often i know we haven't been doing it in our last videos and we did say it but like i don't know we were so busy in the month of december so we forgot to add it like right here but that's why um we gave our last winner a shout out right here and we'll continue to do that in our future videos so the giveaway for this video we will be giving away so it's not gonna be any products in here you know what i'm saying we kind of want you guys to get what you want so we're gonna be giving you guys a 50 dollars gift card to ulta. ulta so that's the giveaway for this video and as always you guys make sure you guys are subscribed to our channel make sure you hit that notification bell as well so you guys get notified every time we upload a new video the rules will be down below yes the rules will be down below and make sure you guys are for sure following us on our instagram because that's where we will be announcing the winner and for every winner on our instagram on our joint account and also follow us on our individual account mm -hmm. the rules are down below for you guys so make sure you guys read them so you guys can enter this giveaway so that's pretty much it you guys we hope you enjoyed this video and we'll catch you guys in our next video bye, bye. is it mattifying my remask or is it supposed to map no same thing what 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 am i saying why am i missing your face <laughs> okay the con <laughs> i'm like, I'm what, like what are you doing, doing? <laughs>